This is the Geneva Shore Report coming to you from the Riviera Pier Complex or just to the west of it. And you can see the bubblers are doing their thing over there. You still have the triangular thing out there in the lake. We don't know why it's thawed right there, but maybe someday we'll go out there and check it out. Uh, you can see the beach here is becoming more of the beach as we get head towards spring, which is not that far away. Anyway, the snowstorm blew south of us and they're still out there putting brine on the road, not making pickles. Uh, but instead, they're getting ready for the snow that's supposed to come either tonight or tomorrow that I don't think is coming either. Anyway, here we are on... It is Tuesday afternoon of February 25th, 2020. I'm Jen Lepkowski. Lisa Otto. And George Blusha Jr. And the Geneva Show Report. Good, Good afternoon. afternoon. We are here for the Tuesday afternoon weather and news report. So right now in the weather. Wow, that is correct. We have no snow actually predicted at all anymore. So hmm. yes, we'll see what happens. But I just followed a brine truck. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what they're doing. But we have 35 degrees. It feels like 25. And the wind picked up just in time. Okay. Ooh, listen to that. Listen to that anemometer go. Oh my gosh. 9.8. 9 9.8. 9 oh, oh, oh. 13 this evening. Yes, it could. Winds could be very strong and they're directly out of the north, so it really puts a bite. Yes, it takes there. your breath away. And yes, the snowstorm is going to miss us. It looks like uh, if we get a dusting, well, we'll be lucky if we get a dusting. So, but it is south of us, which has affected the meeting tonight over in Williams Bay. So originally they had moved to the plan commission meeting for the village of Williams Bay tonight at 6.30 to the Williams Bay High School um, to accommodate all the people that were going to show up, were expected to show up regarding the Yerkes Observatory. The representatives from the University of Chicago and representatives from the Yerkes Future Foundation were both going to give presentations and share some of the future hopes for Yerkes and what could happen with it or what may happen with it. But that meeting has been um, canceled until they're hoping March 10th, but we will confirm that date with you as we get closer. And um, that's the tentative rescheduled date because Chicago is getting Not a storm. Our storm. So, so they were coming out of the University of Chicago yes. and that and would just be too much for them being Chicago people and not Wisconsin people. Yeah, well, yes. yes. Well, we're tough here. <laughs> we can handle it. That's right. We put brine down even when there's no snow. <laughs> no problem. We're we tough. make pickles. We're tough and organic. And then we throw garlic and, and a little bit of, you know, seasoning Dinner. on there. We got yeah. pickles. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Great snack. <laughs> okay. Anyway, tomorrow we have... Well, we have a meeting tonight, oh, though, still at City Hall, 5 p.m. The library, the library boarding committee will be there. They want the committee community's input on what they should do with the inside of the library. But I'm not really sure they can change it or do much. Yeah, it is a uh, Frank Lloyd Or right? how much input they want. Yeah, and um, I'm not sure how much of it can really be changed. Yeah. So we're going to be there. We will find out what they're thinking. These are not usually in, input meetings. They are usually meetings so you can say later on, we did ask the public what we were going to yes. do like when we went psychedelic. Yes, we have had a lot of those. We've had a lot of those. So yeah, I think so. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, that wind. Get out yeah. there. Measure Chris. that. So we have the Beloit International Film Festival that's oh, still going on. And it goes on the rest of the week the weekend. And it's a big one. It's a big one. They have over a hundred films, a hundred yeah. filmmakers. filmmakers. There. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. This is too much. I know. Okay. 9.8 was the highest. All right. My hand's freezing. Are okay. you done? We're going to wrap it up and get on with our evening. We'll be back later with more weather, road, and news reports. I'm Lisa Otto. John Lepkowski. And George Bush Jr. And the Geneva Show Report. Good afternoon. Bye.